What's up, Design Champions? Welcome to Design Time. Happy Tuesday. I hope your week was fantastic. Five stars, two thumbs up. Let's get started. For today's project, we're going to be working with the medium of a landing page. We'll be creating a landing page for Oh, jars, please tell me, what is our project for today? The jars have spoken. It will be a Swedish watch company. We'll be creating a landing page for a Swedish watch company. Let's get started. Okay, design champions, we have to come up with something unique about the Swedish watches. Are they made out of a material? I know there's a lot of companies that make wood watches, so that's an avenue you could go down recycled watches, watches that don't need batteries, watches that are, when you put the watch on, you instantly become invisible. That'd be cool. But what does that have to do with Sweden? You know what we need to do? We need to research more about Sweden. a city called Visby. It's not on the mainland of Sweden actually, it's on a little island called Gotland. What's so cool is that there's so much medieval architecture still there. Here's my idea. Basically, the watches come from Visby and it's a connection between heritage and new Scandinavian modern style. So, basically, this is what happens. The watch has two settings. Number one, classic, minimal, high quality craftsmanship heritage. And then, it's also, you can switch it so that the whole screen becomes a smartwatch. Now, uh, I'll start sketching out some ideas right now. Uh, let's go. I'm gonna find a stock photo of Visby now, and then I'll get started building this big image here. And then maybe I'll do another for down here that'll be a little bit smaller, if, if the first one works. Okay, kiddo fiddos, I put on my focus glasses, no lenses, super cool. I've got um, the watches that I've got set out. I've got all the information I want on the page and I've got um, the main image. So now I'm just gonna speed along and put together the whole thing. Let's go. I'm the master of my future. I spend my time on my oversized computer. I'm the master of my future I spend my whole life a daily commuter my zodiac sign gives you peace of mind and emotional soul I've come to find all a little edgy when we're towed to the line all a little fussy somewhere deep inside we meet we greet we cheat we reap all the little sins that we sow down the line we say we pray never be the same way all the little sins that we left in our wake I'm the master of my future I spend my time on my oversized computer I'm the master of my future I spend my whole life a daily commuter All my plans are in my hands But I'm scared to death Of what goes wrong Takes too long in a single breath I'm the master of my future But my ex always says I'm a loser My bathroom mirror isn't very clear Spots and marks from ear to ear 
Carpe diem, seize the day All my rosebuds withered away Life gave me lemons and I drink them every Sunday Religion in my heart but pretty girls on the runway Break my self control so I find a place to hide away The hashtag goals always make me wanna hide my face I'm the master of my future I spend my time on my oversized computer I'm the master of my future I spend my whole life a daily commuter All my plans are in my hands But I'm scared to death Of what goes wrong Takes too long in a single breath I'm the master of my future Okay, design champions, I'm done with the Swedish watch company landing page. Let's talk about the design. First off, I would rate this six out of 10. It's okay, I think there's a lot of room for improvement. A couple of the things I don't like is, there's no really wow factor. I think it's, it's all pretty muted. I think if we inserted either cooler hero images, or just a more vibrant color somewhere while still maintaining a, a classic look would be great. Um, I think it did a good job of getting kind of a, a classic modernish feel. Yeah, I don't know how well the ideas of kind of a, a classic heritage combined with a modern technology I don't know how well that comes across. I think um, I would work on that a lot more. And I think another thing that's a little bit weird is some of the spacing between the sections. I think the second watch, it looks weird because the band, you can't see the back of the bands. You're like, uh, just fades off into nothing. That's quite weird for me. Some things I do like, I think the layout in general is pretty strong. I like that, where things are positioned are unexpected. It's not really like a perfect grid system, but it's enough where it's not crazy all over the place. Um, so I think that there's a good balance in terms of, of layout and position. And it's a little bit new feeling. Some of the color blocking is really cool too. Overall, like I say, I give it a six out of 10. Let me know what you would rate it, and also leave a comment in, um, like, let's say it's not a 10 out of 10, what would you personally change? Stay tuned for next Tuesday, where there will be another installment of Design Time. And remember, always be better than you were yesterday. Unless yesterday you were perfect, then just do it again. <laughs> well, what am I talking about? You guys are always perfect. Stay awesome, possum, and I'll see you later, alligator. Bye.